Hello everyone, this is Samantha again, and today I have a very special guest with me today. Now, she is the owner and interior designer of Dylan Decor, serving San Antonio, Austin, and the surrounding communities, and has a high presence in model home planning and design. Now, she also holds multiple awards, including residential remodel and commercial remodel at this year's Pinnacle of Design. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I have Dylan Daphne. Welcome, Dylan. Hi, thank you for having me. Yes, Love being here. Yeah, thank you for taking some time and joining us today. I know you're pretty busy as an interior designer. So tell us, how did you get into interior design? Oh goodness, I started in actually more of a commercial aspect. I was doing apartment um, model homes and clubhouses about 25 years ago. Started in that realm and then moved my way up into actual homes. Um, but that's how I got my start in, in just apartments. <laughs> oh, perfect. Now tell us about this year, like we, you know, I mentioned the Pinnacle of Design Awards and you won a couple awards. Tell us about some of the projects that you worked on. Uh, this year for the Pinnacle, um, our third year with Pinnacle with ASID and we're all excited about that and this year I entered um, a, a brand new store that I've opened and designed and Woodco was a huge part of it. Um, we were able to procure the old Jossie's flooring what was left of it through y'all which yay I was so excited. <laughs> that had to be in our store somehow some way and y'all made it happen so that was awesome. Um, that was probably the thing I was most excited about was entering Joy. I also entered some of my model homes and I pretty much always put a touch of reclaimed wood whether it's a beam a wall i did the 3d wall feature in one of the homes um, they were side by side models and i wanted to make sure to showcase them differently so one was a more rustic vibe and the other one was a little bit more of a contemporary vibe so you had everything i needed <laughs> oh perfect so i mean just speaking about that how did you hear about Whitco? you know actually a friend of mine um jenny maples she told me about Whitco probably five years ago now it's been I think at least five years I was driving all the way to Gonzales Texas and you know seeking out anyone that I could find old um, beadboard and just you know beams anything neat and older um, that was coming off of buildings and I was driving a long way to get it and then my friend Jenny said you know we have this place called Whitco and I was like no but I'm going over there now and ever since we've been kind of married oh, so. yeah I know I mean you partner with us a lot we love working with you I mean all of your designs and everything like that I've seen has been incredible thank you so what do you think you know as far as Whitco goes what sets us apart from like others like maybe people you worked for in the past or well, definitely customer service. Um, the whole family, you know, is wonderful to work with. I love the guys. Their accents alone would make me come back. Um, but no, there's always, I really don't think I've ever been told no here. Um, it, even if it takes a little bit more time to get something in, they will source anything for you. Um, we always can agree on price in the end, which is great. And it's available pretty readily. So anything I've done, I really have never been told no. And that's a huge thing. <laughs> if they can't get it, they know how to get it or something like it. So um, yeah, that's customer service, I would say. And and there's a lot of cool new things that you guys have come out in the last year, um, just with the showroom and working on the showroom together with you guys. It's been amazing to see all the new products. So. Yeah, that's perfect. Well, I mean, we look forward to working on many more projects with you. Yes. Now, one last thing for people to take away. You know, this year is almost over. What is the one trend that either took over 2016 or that we're closing it out with? Well, definitely the old shiplap um, <laughs> and, you know, reclaimed wood walls um, with the Chip and Joanna and Fixer Upper on yes. HGTV has kind of caused a little <laughs> bit of a wave. And it's stuff that I've been doing for many, many years, but right now it's still new to San Antonio and new to a lot of people because they see it on national television. So I just keep coming back and continue to do that look. I personally love it, so it doesn't bother me to repeat it. Um, and there's just different ways, but I think for sure the reclaimed wood walls, niches, even if it's just the front of a bar, that accent, and then they're being confirmed by HGTV and that show that they're yeah. on the right you know and then that sends people over because they're like okay well I don't need that much of it where can I yeah. get it so yeah that right. for sure has been the, the big thing this year well so. perfect well thank you, thank you so much oh for gosh. joining me today yeah. it's been great it's and of course great. I'm sure I'll see you again oh yeah, yeah like probably <laughs> tomorrow <laughs> now for more information about Dylan or Woodco's products um be sure to read below and until then we will see you next time bye <laughs>